A vicar? We have asked the vicar. Here we go. If God is merciful, why is there judgment? If God is merciful, why is there judgment? You know, I, I think that question really goes to the very heart of the Christian faith. Because I think it shows us that we use the word judgment in more than one way. One way we use the word judgment is simply to tell the truth about something. When we make a judgment about something, we are judging what, to be, what, it, what we believe to be true about it. We also sometimes use the word judgment to mean condemnation. For God to judge us is for God to see the truth about us, but not to use that truth to destroy us. If you think about the way the media tends to see the truth about someone, no sooner has the media seen what it perceives to be the truth about someone than it uses that to destroy them. God doesn't do that. God sees the truth about us, but doesn't use that truth to destroy us. And that's what mercy means, to know the truth about somebody, but not to use that truth to destroy them, but just to love them more and understand them better. To know and to love is judgment with mercy. The truth is there is no mercy without judgment. That's ignoring or forgetting. Ignoring and forgetting aren't good news. They're just delayed judgment. True mercy comes through judgment, not by escaping it.